Pokemon Shellac 31 here and welcome back. I am very excited. Today we are checking out another anime series. I know, I have so many series going on, I can't even keep track anymore. But I ran into the synopsis of a show called Rent a Girlfriend. Uh, anime is so weird sometimes. But I ran into this and I was like, I need to check this out. This seems like the kind of storyline I love. I know nothing about the series. I'm literally checking it out on Crunchyroll or... Yeah, I think it's Crunchyroll, and I don't have any background of this at all. I just read the synopsis of it's a guy who's like a huge failure in college, and he basically kissed his girlfriend one time and then they broke up. I don't know. And so I guess the story is starting out from there. And I don't know. So I guess let's just check it out. This is season one, episode one of Rent a Girlfriend. Is that your girl? Why are you guys walking so far apart? She just dropped that on him. Poor guy. Well, she wasn't right for you, though, bud. Some people just aren't compatible. What are you doing? Steals your soul. Is this legal? Oh, okay. Mm, I don't know. This kind of sounds like one of those um, adult deals. Ugh! Stop! <laughs> oh, he's meeting her. What? Oh, she's cute! Are you Kazuya? Oh my gosh! Oh, you're in college? What year? First oh. Year. Oh, same for me! But so you have that in common! Uh, oh, he's so failing, right? Hmm? Damn. She have the menu upside she's down? Hot. Sir! Anyone dating her would be seriously living the life. Time I've ever gone to an aquarium! Oh my gosh, really? Is that so? Can you imagine your first time going to an aquarium? I guess everyone had their first time going to an aquarium. But it would be so magical. Oh my gosh, he has got to calm down. It's the first date. She is not going to expect that. Or maybe she is. I don't know. Isn't this date supposed to end with them like... I don't know. See, that was nice. That was a good day. But he's not satisfied. What? Outrageous! Yeah. It was all just an act. Oh. It's part of the routine. How dare she toy with my heart like that? Oh my god. This dude is so this angry. Wait, what did he type? She toy with my heart like that. Let me see. She was a moron who didn't even know the name of a common fish. Okay. <laughs> Wow, you burn. You got him. Use this to get by. Oh my gosh, how much did that I cost you? you any more money for living expenses after this. It didn't wait long. I had to do my hair. I was worried you might not like this. Oh my gosh. Do you like it? I mean, I don't hate it or anything. Why is he so bad at this? Damn it. She's so cute. Oh, they went to the same cafe. Why does he keep doing this? You know, going on dates with guys you don't like and getting paid for it. Okay, but isn't that her whole job? Isn't that the whole thing we're doing here? Is she gets paid to be your girlfriend, like, or to go out with you? That's the whole exchange we're having. So why are you getting salty about her not being totally committed when this is all based off of her getting a paycheck in the first place? That's not love, my guy. Doesn't it get to you? Look, cousin. They went back to the aquarium. Oh, yeah. They're so cute. And garden eels. She must have read up on them. Right? She did her homework. Aww. 
Why is this the same date though? Why did you guys not do anything different? I mean, really? What are you hoping to achieve? Just being professional? You it's so meaningless. These relationships don't last. Stop it. Please calm down. You it's gotten into you, cannot you be mad at her though. Right away. It doesn't matter how much you care about your partner. Perfect. Oh my god, you didn't go on a dating app. You went on a an app for this. Okay, look. What's wrong with you? Are you stupid? Yelling like that in a public place, drawing everyone's attention? What is your problem anyway? All day you've been saying stuff like don't be an empty and we're strangers. Huh? Seriously, are you stupid? I mean I'm a rental girlfriend. This is just how it works. Oh my gosh. You know, who requested this for you? You saw the user agreement and clicked I agree, didn't you? He's got a point. And why did you give me a one-star review anyway? Did I actually do anything wrong on our first date? Uh, huh? Hey, he she did what? Really? You know. I got it. Wait, what happened? What happened? My grand, she passed out. Huh? Oh no! Go now. You go. You go deal with it, but dude. He's got. Time left. He's got family issues. You can just write it off. It's no big deal. I fainted, that's all. But we're still you... worried about you, Mother. Your Why did you fake it? Very important to us. Mom, you gotta realize that you aren't as young as you used to be. Who's this young lady? Oh my gosh, he brought her with them? Because she was with Kazuya. Oh, this is so uncomfortable. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Perfect. It's too bad I had to introduce myself this is... under these circumstances. But still, I'm glad to meet you all. No. No. Both of you. Yes. Oh, and they're not going to want to break her heart. They're going to do it. We're heading back to the store. Oh, by the way, you two. Have you had sex already? Oh my gosh. <laughs> She just dropped the ball so hard. What do you mean, marriage? She just she went right over the curve. She didn't even stop. She just asked him straight out, just straight out of the gate. I'm sure she's had to do it before. Oh my gosh, is it really that big of a shock he's got a girlfriend? He had a girlfriend that they were together for like a month. I was gonna say, how are you gonna do that? Yeah, okay. But how am I gonna distract them? Figure it out Just tell them that she had a family emergency or something. Oh my gosh, why did you hide under the blanket? Oh my gosh, why did you do that? This is the biggest crisis ever. Have you seen a young couple around here? She thinks it's someone else? She thought she thought someone else was. Is this this is not normal in a hospital? I'm sure for you just walk in and see. Okay. Being this close is deadly. Is that really you, Chizuru? Um. Yes. Oh no! Are you telling me that your grandson's girlfriend is Chizuru? <sighs> Everyone who's alive gets lonely now and then. Huh. Some are just good at hiding it, and they all fill the void in their hearts with work or their relationships. <sighs> I'll tell Grant I'm sorry. And introduce a real girlfriend to her sometime. Yeah, I was gonna say, we can't do this. Just, it's not right. 
Just by renting it, can't you? Yeah. And you two don't. Oh. What was that for? What was that for? Me corny. Really? Wow. So it's fine to be corny. Friends and stuff, and like live. I don't want anything like today's date to happen again. But if you We're not really gonna do this. Like rabbit, you can call me. <laughs> no, we're not really gonna do this. Really? I doubt I'll see Chizu and Mizuhara again. For your sake, probably a good thing. Don't turn to her anymore. I'm done with pretend dating forever. Uh the spirit? Oh, here's this girl. Well, no, you just you walk the other way. Hello? It's not her. Are you kidding me? Get out of here. Does she go here? Wait, is this not her? Who's that? Wait, what was that? Okay. Wow. Okay, so that was season one, episode one of Rent a Girlfriend. Um, okay, let's talk about it. I hope that you guys don't mind me like laughing hysterically in the background to the video to the episode because there were times where either they'd say outrageous things and i'm like nobody says that or they just caught me off guard because they were they were so wavering the two characters can't remember their names i'm sorry but the the guy and the girl character just they'd either be really nice for a second and talking and be like kind of like oh they're becoming friends and then she slaps them out of nowhere or they'd be having a nice moment in the aquarium and then they start fighting hysterically about everything. So it, I don't know. These two should not be in a relationship. And I'm not saying that because they can't become compatible, but okay, so first off, it's it's wrong because they're forcing a romance based off of her feeling not only guilty but also feeling um obligated, feeling obligated because she's getting paid so like of course she's not gonna say no to him paying her to do this when she said many times she wants to do this she is doing this she has to do this so he's going to continue paying her which his bank is going to be laughing at him because he is going to spend so much money and i know he really wants to please his grandma because he wants to have the love of his life meet her and you know before she dies but I feel like the grandma would be even more disappointed for you lying to her. And I, I guess it's one of those things where it's kind of a wavering of like, is it better to do the right thing and lie? Or is it better to be truthful and hurt somebody? And that's that's kind of a that's kind of hard to, to, you know, decide. But I don't know personally that this they should be together because it just seems wrong seems unfaithful like it seems untrue to who they are and again she, he's just paying her and it's just a job to her but did i have a good time while watching this show absolutely it was a lot of fun it was really eye-opening to the um kind of anime it is i did not realize there were going to be some scenes that were a little questionable but apparently this is kind of like and i guess what did i expect from a show called rent a girlfriend i'm sure they're were gonna be moments like this where they were either like moments like where they you know address the romantic both physical and mental and all that so i don't know but i really enjoyed it for what it was and i hope you guys did too if you enjoyed the video or want me to check out more be sure to leave a like on the video thank you so much for watching thank you for staying awesome and until next time guys bye they say she's in the class 18 stuck in her day